Cisco Technologies Private Limited. My name is Shambhavi and today we are going to discuss about the Benchtop Oscilloscope and the charter code is DSO 7012V. So in this video we are going to see how the DSO works. So this is our Benchtop Oscilloscope and we have given it 230 volt AC power supply and then starting with the display so we can see that there are two lines on the display so the first one that is red one is representing the channel one and the yellow one is representing the channel two so these are the ports for channel one and channel two and these are the uh, given for the controlling controlling of the vertical position of channel one and channel two so using these we can control the positions of both the channels and this is the volts per division so we are having different functions here as well so starting with the first one that is measure function to measure frequency voltage peak to peak or rms this is the save button this is the utility cursor to move the functions and then this is the display acquire auto set auto scale and this is the help button so we will see the graphs so we use crocodile probes in dso so these are the crocodile probes that we are going to use so we will connect both the crocodile probes at channel 1 and channel 2 so we are not doing any experiment here so it's just that we have to see the graphs on the DSO so we will use the DSO only and we will see the default graph that is in this to just see the graphs here so as we can see the graph that is displayed on the screen so we have connected so this uh, benchtop oscilloscope is of 1 kilohertz so we can use these so we can see the channel 1 vertical position, the graph is shifting in vertical direction, same for the same for the channel 2 and these are the voltage for division. So now we can see the measure function and these keys uh, are given on the sides of the oscilloscope to move the cursors up and down so here we can see the add function so we will add so here we have different type frequency period mean voltage peak to peak rms so we have selected frequency here then source channel 1 channel 2 so we have selected channel 1 here and then we will press this to add we can see here the frequency 1 uh, frequency of channel 1 is 1 kilohertz and same for the channel 2 that is also 1 kilohertz so this is how we can use the oscilloscope so that was all the demonstration from my side if you have any query regarding this product you can contact us at Tesco global website and the link is given in the description and if you like the video please like share and subscribe our channel thank you for watching the video